We confess our faith together using the words of the Apostles' Creed. I believe in God the Father Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. The third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and sits at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From thence he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Christian Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. Beloved in the Lord, let us draw near to the Lord's throne of grace and pray as he has commanded us, trusting in the Lord to hear the prayers of his people and answer our petitions according to his mercy. O most merciful God, Lord of heaven and earth, we pray you to so rule and govern your church and all her pastors and ministers that she may be preserved in the pure doctrine of your saving word defended against all adversity, and protected from all adversaries, that thereby faith may be strengthened and love increased in us. O Lord, have mercy. Grant health, wisdom, and integrity to all in authority over us, especially the President of the United States, the Governor of this state, the Congress, all legislative bodies, and all judges and magistrates. Endow them with your spirit and respect for your word, that they would serve your good pleasure for the maintenance of righteousness and the punishment of wickedness, so that we may all lead a quiet and peaceful life in all godliness and honesty. According to your gracious will, turn the hearts of our enemies and make them to walk with us in humility and peace. O Lord, have mercy. Grant to those in trouble, want, sickness, anguish of labor, peril of death, or any other adversity, the healthful spirit of your grace for healing, strength, comfort, and relief. Bless especially those who suffer for the sake of your name and your word. Hear us on behalf of John and Christine and all others we name in our hearts. Give them courage to stand firm in their afflictions and patience until the day of your deliverance. O Lord, have mercy. preserve us from pestilence and every evil. Give to us favorable weather and grant us rain for the earth. Cause the fruits of the earth to prosper, that we may enjoy them in due season and offer your praise and thanksgiving for all your goodness to us. Lend your blessing to all honorable vocations and honest industry that we may serve where our skills and abilities may be of good use. Bless the arts and music that we may please you and be encouraged by all that is good, right, true, and beautiful. O Lord, have yeah, mercy. Give to all husbands and wives grace to live together in love and faithfulness. Bless the homes and families of your people that they may be places where your name is honored and love is nurtured. Give your special grace to the widow, the orphan, all mothers with child, the aged and the infirm, that we may grant them comfort, aid, and protection. O Lord, have, have mercy. mercy. All these things for which you would have us ask of you, we pray you to grant us for the sake of the bitter sufferings and death of Jesus Christ our Lord, through whom we are bold to call you Father, and in whose name we pray trusting in your mercy, and confident that you will give answer to our prayers through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. As we uh, bring our offerings at the door when we enter currently, we now sing the offertory, page 159. What shall I render to the Lord?
come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine on you and be gracious to you. The Lord look upon you with favor and give you peace. Amen. We sing 656, A Mighty Fortress.
glad you joined us this morning. Pray God's blessing on your week and uh, upcoming celebration of Independence Day. Uh, Elizabeth, you have something? Announce. There's a birthday this week. Uh, happy birthday to Jeff Walter on the second. Oh, what's it for? Very glad to have you join us today again, and God be with you through the week. God bless.